Hi, this is Mato. In this video I will show very instructive chess game. This is the game between Gennady Sosonko and Robert Hibna that was played in Tilburg in 1979. And where is Tilburg? It is a city in the Netherlands. Sosonko had white pieces and he started with d4. Hibna played knight to f6, c4, e6, g3 and white is indicating that he would like to play Catalan opening. d5, bishop to g2 and black captured pawn on c4. White can immediately regain the pawn with queen to a4 and after bishop to d7 queen takes pawn and material is equal. But Sosonko continued with knight to f3. A6, indicating that he wants to play b5 to protect the pawn. White can play a4 to prevent b5, but then black would play c5. So white castled kingside, b5, and black is a pawn up. Question is, would you like to be a pawn up or to have better development? and activity of the pieces. Would you prefer to be white or black in this position? Let's have a look at the game. Knight to e5 was played. Bishop is attacking rook on a8. Knight to d5, knight to c3, and black played c6. Perhaps better was bishop to b7. But black had a different plan. He played c6, and now this looks super solid, doesn't it? Knight takes knight, and black captured with e pawn because he wanted to develop his bishop to e6. e4, bishop to e6, a4, attacking the pawn chain. Of course, black is advised not to capture that pawn on a4. This is much better for white now. So black played b4. Pawn takes pawn and black captured the bishop. And now in this position white made a very strong move. And that is queen to g4. Black would like to castle kingside. Of course, bishop to e7 or bishop to d6 doesn't work because queen takes on g7. So, h5 was played, attacking queen. What are the other options? Maybe, maybe g6 was the best. I think that could be the best move. Uh, what are the other moves? Bishop takes on g2 is not good for this reason. Rook to e1, threatening discovered check and winning queen. After bishop to e7, queen takes pawn on g7 attacking rook. Rook to f8, king takes bishop and white is better. h5 was played and we have reached critical position of the game. It is white to move. If you wish, you can pause this video and you can try to find the killer move that white played in this position. Are you ready? What did you find? Queen to d1 is not a killer move. Looks like more like a chicken move. <laughs> In the game, White surprised his opponent. He didn't move his queen. He captured bishop on d5. Black had a good look and decided not to take queen. Why not? Let's have a look. If pawn takes queen, then bishop takes on f7 check after king to e7, bishop to g5 check, 
and after king to d6, bishop takes queen, and white is a piece up. So, black didn't capture queen, he captured bishop on d5. Queen to f5, threat is checkmate on f7. If queen to f6, then queen to c8 check, and after queen to d8, queen takes queen, king takes queen, knight takes on f7 check, and winning rook. So black played rook to a7, rook is defending pawn on f7, rook to e1, threatening discovered check, winning queen, rook to e7, Bishop to g5, attacking rook. Can black play f6? No. Why not? If f6, then queen to g6, check. And after rook to f7, queen takes rook. Check. Mate. So black played g6, attacking queen. And how would you continue now? First thing that comes to mind is to move queen to safe place. So I think this is one of the moves that comes to mind, but another surprise from white. He didn't move his queen. He captured rook on e7, and believe it or not, black didn't bother to capture queen. Black resigned. Let's check what would happen if black continued. If pawn takes queen, bishop takes queen, and white is a piece up. Of course, if king takes bishop, the knight takes on f7 check, and white is winning a rook. What else can black play in this position? Maybe. He can take with bishop, what do you think? And then checkmate. Hmm. And one more. What about queen takes? Is that good? Then we would have this continuation. Check. Queen to d8. And discovered check. Bishop to e7. And the last move is queen takes queen, check, mate. What a game. Hmm. How do you like this game? Would you like to be a pawn up or to have better activity of the pieces? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess. And bye for now.